just here sipping on a tea. You're on this adventure right here. If you want to click that video, you can see where I'm at now, get some context. But today, I want to talk about this. This is an axe that was a gift to me from my dad. Might not seem like much, but wait till I tell you the story. So anybody that knows me know that I love uh, love culture and heritage and, and things of old, essentially. I love uh, back, say, 50 years ago or 100 years ago when old tools was were used, which is why I love my axes and my saws. And you've seen all kinds of tool restorations. I shave with straight razors. I just love really eclectic things like that. To me, it's really interesting. And you got to admit, it's pretty cool. Well. Back in Newfoundland, back in the day, the logging industry used to be huge. And uh, in particular, back in the 1940s, there was a camp called Camp 13. This was a camp uh, near Gander, Newfoundland. I believe it was Southwest Gander. I haven't read the entire book yet, but I'm picking my way through it. It's a book written by Byron White. It's not real expensive if you want to find it on Amazon. But uh, this is sort of Byron White took the uh, story of Camp 13 from a lot of the elders back in the day and uh, he had a big interest and sort of created this story based on that camp and uh, I'm picking my way through right now uh, and I absolutely love it it's fantastic as far as I know this is a Camp 13 axe my dad works construction without giving you too many details this axe was dug up where the Camp 13 site was uh, was stationed back in the 1940s, uh, and it went on l much later than that, so so it wouldn't not necessarily from the 1940s. But uh, this axe was found. I'll just give you a close up of it. You can see that pitting is very deep, very deep, but it's still a super solid axe. Just look how great that profile is. How great those that taper is! You got a nice big eye, lots of meat back here, but yet it comes into that super fine, almost knife-like edge. That uh, drooping heel here, that I, I love that sort of that swept back toe, nice radius here. This is a nice axe head, and uh, I'm super excited. I'm gonna do a full restoration on this one. I'm gonna take you through refurbishing the head. We're going to hang a handle on there. We're going to do a custom sheath. This very well might be my next favorite axe. I'm just, uh, I'm thrilled to have this kind of heritage. That's right up my alley. So, uh, very excited about it. Stay tuned for the next video on Camp 13 Axe.